take a look at this one. Here is one cool custom. So we got a 1960 Chevrolet Biscayne is how this started life before a full blown frame off restoration making this thing into a custom resto rod that is unbelievable. So let me just look at the lines and look at this thing. All right, first of all, paint. I would call it, it's darker than a silver. Maybe not as dark as a dark gray. This, let's call it like a smoky silver, light gray. You get the picture. And this paint is laid on here nice. It is smooth. The clear is beautiful. I mean, you can see the reflection. It's just I can't get away from the reflect, reflection of the lights off the ceiling. Um, just an incredible paint on it. Uh, any of the bright work re-anodized as far as the grill headlight bezels. Look at this up here. You know what it's like to try to find one of those grills in this shape. Chrome, all replated. So that's why your chrome bright work, all of that is so good. And then of course it'll be that way all the way around when we get back to the trim pieces on the fins in the rear of the 60. Uh, we'll check those out. It's beautiful black back there also. This car was a professional build over a three year period. Like I said, frame off restoration. Very customized. Um, you know, it was built to be a mild custom, but uh, nice car built to show. You walk away with trophies wherever you're going to go with this and or drive it. I mean, this thing was made to drive. So as far as the uh, engine, LS1, that is paired with a 4L6E matching transmission. So you're talking overdrive, modern day amenities in this thing. Uh, it'll go down the road. 1500 rpm 70 miles an hour and uh, it's riding on ride tech air ride so you can set it up you got weight in the back you want to firm it up in the back a little bit you don't want anybody riding with you you want to change it around go right ahead now four wheel disc brakes and slotted and drilled rotors all the way around it uh, the engine bay is just as neat as can be and we're going to check out the still pictures or i'll let you check out the still pictures tell you where to do it we'll do a video i'll pop the hood so you can see it and everything too um these wheels on it those are hot rod by boyd crowbar wheels we got 20s in the front 22s in the rear again slotted and drilled rotors behind that of course you got power steer power steering ac serpentine belt system underneath that hood now check out the engine bay pictures underside pictures interior still pictures are at unique classic cars.com down below this video in the description there's a link click on it it's going to take you right there uh, feel free to call us too. You got questions on this? 507 386 1726. Of course, the Biscayne and this windshield, just a beautiful look. We got the post, and of course, these wings in the back. We'll get around to the interior here in a little bit too, but I'll tell you, it is a white with gray accent and some custom stuff done in there. Also, very, very nice. Uh, one other thing I want to point out is look, they've cut away have the exhaust exiting how cool is that Flowmaster exhaust on it by the way headman headers the three tail light conversion back here to LEDs and they are sequential so those will do sequential uh, blinkers and brake light now we do consider trades financing is available we can assist you with getting this car to where you're located at. And of course, it may be eligible for an extended service contract. So consult with your sales associate when you call in or email us. All right, come back here and look at this chrome. And again, the bright work on it. Just wow. This is definitely a showstopper. be a fun one to take down the highway driving to that's the thing about it you can drive it or you can show it do a little of both and look at how straight this car is up and down both sides of it absolutely beautiful you can't beat those fins in the body body styling in the 60s either all right anything else on my cheat sheet i want to go over with you let's get to the interior here let's go through some of this all right First of all, carpeting. Mercedes-Benz carpeting was put into this, and it is plush. We have white leather, diamond sewn, 
inserts and seats. And look at the custom form seats, lumbar, recline, metal, custom made center console. Of course, we get up in here, we do have tilt column, gauges. I think there's about 2,200 miles on this since the build. 2,223 it shows. All right, like I said, let me look at my cheat sheet because I want to tell you a little bit about the stereo too. Um, custom cutouts in the dash are created and the billet aluminum vents were put in. Let's just take a look at this. Custom cutout, billet aluminum vents put in for the AC outlets. And again, a metal custom made center console. There's your power windows. And you would have manual wing windows where you could open them over there. Down below in the kick panels, Custom made for the speakers. And then a touch screen Alpine stereo system here. And this does have the Apple CarPlay. It has a backup screen. Uh, some more goodies there. Um, there's also some custom, I believe, red, green, and blue LEDs that are into the door panels. And center console. Give you a kind of a dimmable and full color spectrum for a little custom inner glow in here. And then you're wondering about the air ride controls right there custom mounted all your AC and heat controls there just like they normally would be now let's go ahead and start this up remember we got an LS1 fuel injected so this thing's gonna fire right up it appears there is also like XM or serious radio capabilities there's an antenna and there's your I guess it won't show up very good there you go with the Radio lighting up. Cool gauge cluster. What a what an add to this. Alright. Look at all that closes. And that's the other thing. Look at these body how it fits. The door fits in the body is so straight. Just look at that. All the way around it. Like I said, this is a beautiful custom build. I want to show you the hood too before I pop it. There's your exhaust outlet. Listen to that. What a great sound. All right, let's slip up to this hood. I want to show you how this fits and the alignment of this hood also. Look it up and down that. Look at how straight that is. Look at this side. Absolutely incredible. All right, I'm gonna pause this uh, video here a second. Let's get this hood popped so you can see this engine bay. All right, here we go. And you know it's gonna be as nice under here as it is on the outside. First of all, check out cold air intake. I don't know if you can see it. There's screens here for air to come up through the fender well, custom built into there. Then the LS1, power steering, power brakes, AC, reliable engine. Incredible headman headers, like I said earlier. Full master exhaust. We have serpentine belt system. Look at how smooth that runs. AC blows cold, by the way. I had the AC going in it earlier. Blows cold. Um, I'm sure there's a few things I've missed along the way. You might see, you got questions on. Like I said, feel free to give us a call on this one. 507-386-1726. Uh, uh, underside pictures. Check out the trunk. It didn't pop the trunk, but check out the trunk. Also finished nice. A uh, little Biscayne lettering sewn in there. Check that out. There's uh, appears to be an onboard battery tender cord back there to plug in. This thing's got everything. Check out the still pictures, uniqueclassiccars.com. Down below this video, in the description, there's a link. Click on it. It's going to take you right there. Uh, of course, we can assist you in getting this car to where you're located at. We do consider trades. Financing is available, and it may be eligible for an extended service contract. Give, give us a call, one-off, 1960. Chevrolet Biscayne, absolutely beautiful.